Um, this is going to be for the XOX tag um, by XOX Rufus. So, hello. Um, I love you. First of all, you're adorable. Um, so, yeah, I'm just going to go straight into the questions. One, what is the one thing you've always wanted to make but failed every time you tried? Well, I haven't actually tried it, so I guess this isn't really answering the question. But I'm really scared to um, make uh, charms that look that are supposed to look like something, like a real Akuma or, I don't know, a Hello Kitty head, because I feel like I would be so, like, exact about how it was made that I would, like, be really obsessive about making it, like, exactly right. So, I, like, don't even try to do that. I just make food, because food can look like whatever. Uh, so, yeah, I, um, haven't really tried that, but I probably would fail at it, because I'm really impatient with clay, and I just kind of want to, like, boom, be done with it, and it looked really cute. Um, so, yeah, I probably would fail miserably at anything that takes more than, like, five minutes to make with clay. Two, who would you uh, art slash charm trade with if you could? Well, obviously you, of course, because you're awesome. Uh, I would really like to trade with, I'm terribly embarrassed right now that I don't know the name, um, but I'll put it on the screen, but I saw the burger mirror that she made, and I really, really love hamburgers, like Kawhi burgers, so I would really love that. And then I found a person through your channel, actually, I saw you commented on theirs, and they draw really amazingly, and I'll also put the name here because I don't remember, but they're amazing, and I am a graphic designer, so I think they're really awesome, and I love what they do, so I would love to trade with them, too. Three! If you could only use three colors of art material, which would you pick? I know a lot of people are saying pink, chocolate, and white, or chocolate, pink, brown, and white, and I have to say that I would pretty much choose those two, but if I wanted to be really awesome and stray away from that, I would say pink, white, and turquoise, which is, those are my favorite colors, so. But, actually, if I wanted to be really awesome, I would say the primary colors, and then I could just mix whatever colors of clay I wanted, so, boom. Yeah. Four. When you fail at making something, do you give up or keep trying? It depends on what it is. I generally am the type that if I can't sit down in one sitting and make it, then I'm kind of like, no more, and I just kind of don't do it. Or I just do it in a less time-intensive way. So if I think of something in my head that would take a really long time to do, then I will usually just think of a faster way to do it that's maybe not as good. I started making a quilt, and I haven't finished it yet, and it's really bad because all the squares are different sizes and they're not supposed to be. Um, so that's something that I'm like, I keep trying at, but it's just been a really long time, so I guess I kind of gave up, but I haven't yet because I still have the squares. So it's kind of, it's kind of a hard question. Generally, if something's really annoying me, then I'll just give up and do something that's faster. So I guess give up. Five. Do I hoard my charms or do I not really mind giving them away? I've given away a few charms. Charms to me is something that I make to give in a way, I guess, because clay is really expensive to me at least, like for the little tiny block. So I feel like it's better if I give it away to feel like I kind of like that money was used for something good besides just keeping it. Um, so yeah, I really like making things for other people. So I try, I don't really, I have some things that I hoard. I like to, I like to hoard my Whipple because Whipple is like awesome for me. I hoard, I hoard my squishies. I don't know how all these people are trading, trading their squishies. I'm like, I want to keep mine. But anyway, so yeah, those are all the questions. I've had a lot of side, um, tracking. Um, but yeah, so I hope you enjoyed this video and you're awesome. And yeah, so that is all. Bye!